Mon Man Cymru, the mother of Wales. It's an old saying um, going back, well, hundreds of years that uh, way, uh, Anglesey was feeding Wales in, in years gone by. Anglesey, of course, is rich in a, a wealth of variety, a variety of landscape from, you know, cliffs and sand dunes and big wide beaches and woodlands and views across to the stunning sort of Snowdonia Mountains beyond. So there's always plenty of things to photograph every time you go out. The island has approximately 125 miles of coastal footpath. Uh, taking in some of the most fantastic coastal scenery, most of which is, uh, has been designated as an area of outstanding natural beauty. It's a varied landscape, it's varied weather, it's varied light, and that's what gives you the intrigue and the interest every time you go out. So that even if you went to the same beach any number of times, it'll always look different, so it feels like you're going to a new place each time. There's a special feel to the island, you know, the coastline, the open skies. It's sort of a very special feeling on an island like this, because it's small, but there is plenty here as well. The island, and perhaps Bill Morris in particular, has been looked upon as the place to eat, not just on the island, but really in North Wales. But there's some fab fabulous restaurants here, tremendous hotels. Well, there's varied attractions available for, for families. You know, you've got the adrenaline-type activities, such as the karting here at Catamon. You've got sea kayaking, windsurfing, all sorts. You've got the more tame then, your golf, cycling, plenty of walks and things. So, you know, there is a vast variety of things to do on the island. People are warm and friendly here. It's unspoiled, it's unshowy. Um, it has that special feel about the place which appeals to me and to many people who come and stay with us. We've certainly got some very, very eminent artists producing some extremely good work um, that are in a way heralding and pioneering Anglesey as, as an amazing place to find inspiration for artwork. To have William and Kate on the island is a great honour to us all and I hope that um, they will find the peace and tranquillity as we all do on the island. The great thing about um, Prince William and Kate is that they are really quite down to earth. You know, you often hear about them turning up in various locations on the island, various pubs and shops. I understand that Prince William took part in um, the um, quiz night in his local pub. I think we're very proud that they are setting up home on the island for their early years of marriage. Um, and hopefully you know, that they are going to enjoy the peace and quiet of the island before they do settle into their royal life. <laughs>